<laughs> All right. Well, my man puts up a post about Lizzo being way overweight, fat, jiggling everywhere. And all these memes about 50 Cent, because he's a little overweight, but he's still got the muscle. He's still able to hang upside down for the Super Bowl. But it's amazing that the double standard exists where women like to empower other women even when they're out of shape and look crazy. We can't even say the three-letter word F-A-T anymore because they feel like it's, it's not fair. But it's true. A lot of our women are overweight and it's crazy. A lot of our women are just pure out of shape. And you think that just by, you know, glorifying it, yeah, girl, it's okay, whatever. Love you. You got to love your inner self and all that kind of stuff. That doesn't take away the fact that the men are going to judge you. The men don't want to see that craziness. The men, the men like what they like. Point blank period. The men like what they like. And you can't be mad at men if they don't like what they don't like. So I said all this to say today, you know, it just bugs me out that I put so many positive posts when I'm trying to show and teach the brothers to do the right thing, teach the women, you know, the right thing. If I put a positive post, people, certain people don't like it. They ignore it. They don't want to, you know, discuss it. But if I put a controversial post, like this video is going to be controversial because I'm talking about women's weight and women don't want to talk about it because nine times out of ten, most of them are overweight, out of shape. And, you know, they, they could say, well, you, you, you're you not in shape. Well, guess what? I, I'm working on everything I do. Everything I do. I'm 50 years old. And I'm going to probably have a very nice body come summertime when I turn 51. But that's beside the point. My point is the double standards are crazy, ladies. And the women, the women nowadays, it's crazy. 28% of most men admit to cheating. 24% of women admit to cheating. So women cheat just as much as men. Women file for divorce seven out of 10 times. It's the woman that files for divorce. So that would tell you women aren't picking the right man for them. So women, ladies. You don't know how to pick the right man for you. If seven out of 10 of y'all end up in divorce anyway, that means you married a man that you want to get away from. That's ridiculous. That is ridiculous. And the structure of the black family depends on marriage and two parent households raising a family with children. So the more we get away from it, the more we act like it's not an issue and we get comfortable with single parents in the household raising kids, the worse the problem is going to get. It's going to get worse. It's going to get worse. So I'm not going to talk y'all to death. I'm just here. It's a Wednesday hump day. You know, I'm moving around, exercising, stretching, just trying to enjoy life. But I had to get that off my chest for the day. So that's just, uh, that's just, uh, let me vent part one. I got a part two, three, four, five, all the way to 1177. So enjoy your Wednesday. We'll see what happens later.